Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if Windows was unable to load the registry. This problem is often caused by insufficient memory or insufficient security rights. And there's a little detail that appears underneath it there that says that the process cannot access the file because it is being used by another process. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. No pun intended. And let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we're going to start by opening up the start menu. Type in CMD. Best result should come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, go ahead and select yes. And now into this elevated command line window, go type in SFC and then a space forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word, attach that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard to run this command. It will take some time to run, so please be patient.
All right, so we see it did not find anything, which is good. Um, one more thing we can do here if we close out of here would be to open up the start menu, type in this PC, select it from the list here, and then right click on your local drive where Windows is installed on. You see a little Windows icon above a hard drive. Go ahead and right click on that and select properties. Select tools and then error checking. This option will check the drive for file system errors and go ahead and select check. Select scan drive. Okay, so once that's done, click on close, would suggest restarting your computer, and then hopefully your issues should have been resolved. So, as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. do hope that I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.